Taking a look at our fair fair first alert live radar scattered showers out there right now pushing in from the southwest. We're looking at temperatures 50s to 60s out there this morning. 60 degrees right now in Savannah still seeing 64 in some of our southern areas this morning. And as we go through today, as we talked about all day rain chance is going to be out there going to be tracking those breezy winds gusts up to 25 miles per hour and more warmer temperatures 68 degrees. So what I'm gonna look at for a high temperature. We'll still look for mid 60s by five o'clock and higher rain chances as we head into the afternoon. Before we break that down for you, here's what I'm looking at for our highs. Mid to upper 60s. Could see a few spots in our southern areas. Maybe one or two of them actually make it into the lower 70s, but I'm still going to look for the coolest spot to be in those mid 60s along our coast and pretty much timing everything out for you. As we go into this morning, still looking at a little bit of a delay for that, uh, the rain getting to Savannah, but it's going to be more widespread, just continuous rain as we head into the morning. Then as we go into the afternoon, you can see more bubbles of just sporadic weaker thunderstorms. Not going to look for anything severe as we head into today, but we'll continue tracking more of that sporadic erratic thunderstorm development as we head into the overnight and throughout most of the day tomorrow. So breaking that down for you, Christmas Day, nothing severe, slightly breezy, scattered rain all throughout the day. This system going to be pushing out of the area as we go into tomorrow, but we'll still have those lingering showers and rain chances definitely through the morning hours and a little bit into the afternoon. Once again, still not expecting anything severe, but after this system works its way out, dry air comes back into play and much cooler temperatures going to be working their way in. We'll look for starting temperatures tomorrow around 60 degrees. By the time we get to Friday, we're back in the upper 30s and it's going to be mid 30s as we head into New Year's Day weekend. But still just look for temperatures to continue cooling into those mid 50s for our highs as we head into the weekend. We've got a series of cold fronts that are going to be pushing their way into the area, bringing more of those sunny conditions, but also a little bit of breezy weather with it as well. And just lots of cooler temperatures and dry conditions as we head into the rest of 2023 and on into the start of 2024. So putting all that together, rainy conditions out there today still still going to be tracking some of those rain chances into tomorrow and a few isolated chances going into Wednesday. Then we still have a series of cold fronts that are going to be pushing through the area. It's going to take those temperatures from the upper 60s down into the mid 50s by the time we get to Friday and then it's looking like a below average start to 2024 as we head into New Year's Eve. Uh, but still throughout the next week going to be looking for a little over an inch for areas of the low country one to two here in Savannah and a little bit less for our southwest areas and the majority of that is going to happen over the next three days. So as always, we'll be sure to keep you informed on what to expect. However, let's go ahead and take a look at your